Thank you for coming to dinner, my friends. Dinner was lovely. Oh, by the way, my sweet, I cheated on you. But I know you'll forgive me. You are such a loving person, after all. What? Oh. Okay. Oh, she's right. You're just one of the friendliest people I have ever met. Just so friendly. I just know you're gonna lend me two hundred dollars. Why, yes, I suppose I am quite friendly. <laughs> oh, how modest. In fact, I'm so confident in your companionship, I just know you're going to invite my friend Jerry over. Oh, sure. Where is he? And where do I get a hold of him? He's upstairs, in your room. I told him he could take a nap on your bed because he was so tired. Why don't you go ask him if he'll join us? You amazing person, you. <laughs> amazing. How nice of you, Goblin. I'll go fetch him. Hello? Jerry? Oh. Hello. I hope you don't mind, but I killed your dog. What? I killed your dog. Oh. Well, I suppose the dog was a bit of an old bloke anyway. Ah, oh, that's alright. Oh, good. Because I did the same thing to your mother. Well, yes. Anyway, Goblin wants to know if you'd like to join us for dinner. Oh, no. Uh, being the wealthy man that you are, I cleaned out your fridge, so I'm pretty stuffed. <laughs> well, I suppose I am pretty wealthy from all my accomplishments. Well, I better get back to my mates. Nice meeting you, Jerry. Well, I expect you to cuddle me when you come back. All right, where were we? Well, I believe you were about to offer me a massage. You look like you would be good at it. Do you work out? Oh, listen, lately I'm starting to get this feeling. It, uh... Something the matter, Paul. Well, yes, but I'm not sure if it's right to say. Spit it out, Paul. We're your friends, and we're here for you. <sighs> All right. Well, lately, it seems like you guys have been friends with me just to get favors off me. <gasps> Are you saying we're manipulating you? Well, I think that we should leave to give Paul here a little time to calm down. I've never been so disrespected in all my life. This is an outrage! How dare you lash out at us, your friends! No! Wait! I'm sorry! Well, Paul, I'm sorry it didn't work out with your friends. But at least you still have me. Yes, we're quite close for comfort. Yes, uh, you're a very reassuring friend. Reassure me with a lullaby. Wait, I, I, I don't know any. Do it! You fantastic friend. Fantastic? Well, all right. Lullaby, go to sleep, go to sleep, little Jerry. When